Netflix YouTube channel. So in organic hacks, the series shall be three. We'll do another reaction in that today. And this is another important reaction from the P-block chapter in class 11th NCRT. Um, so here reaction diborane preparation I mentioned. Hai. So it is a reaction of NABH4 with iodine, right? Uh, it is an important reaction because obviously it's diborane be produced. Another thing is my hydrogen be produced. So kabhi, uh, kabhi usko se bhi hai. And it has been asked in J multiple times before. So there's a possibility ki again it might be asked. Or uh, reaction would be a deep select is products are kind of mushkil. Hai. So today will help you uh, demystify this reaction. So the thing is, let's see the reaction first. So reaction is NABH4, right? Reacts with iodine, produces diborane, which is B2H6. You also get hydrogen and you get NI. You can balance this reaction, right? Two here. Uh, no, sorry, not two here. My mistake. I will just use the eraser. Two here. Anyway, uh, so let's continue. So this is the reaction. So we will analyze NABH4 first. So NABH4 is an ionic compound, right? So you can think of it as Na plus and BH4 minus. Again, BH4 minus can be thought of as being BH3 coordinated to H minus, right? So basically, what we have on NABH4 to the breaking, so we'll think of it as Na plus, I, uh, Na plus, BH3, right? And H minus. So now iodine will react with it. So iodine, what will Iodine is a reducing agent. Sorry, iodine itself wants to get reduced and it wants to oxidize, right? I, iodine wants to keep the negative charge with itself. So we'll see negative charge is here. So the negative charge is H minus. Yeah, this iodine is more electronegative, so it will want this negative charge with itself. So it will oxidize this H to H minus to H and keep itself reduced to I minus, right? So negative charge is chain layer or it's uh, neutral card layer. So what will happen? H dot and I minus. Ban now let's see what happens. Na plus or I minus, hai. so ionic interaction, NaI ban jayega, one product. Then BH3 B hai or HB. Hai. So these are radicals, right? And they, they can dimerize, they're unstable. So what will happen is B2H6, right? H to radical 3 and BH3 we know prefers to dimerize, it is unstable because it's a octet complete here. So it tries to do, attain that by dimerizing and you'll form H2 here. So this way you can remember the products. So again, NABH4, think of it as an ionic compound, Na plus and BH4 minus. BH4 minus again is H minus coordinated to BH3, right? So NABH4 we will write it as Na plus, BH3 and H minus. I2 uh, will try to oxidize H minus and itself gain the negative charge. So you'll form H radicals and I minus. So now you have Na plus and I minus, right? So you get NAI. Right, and then you have BHC, it is unstable, it dimerizes B2H6. H radicals are also unstable, they also dimerize, so you get H2. So in this way, you produce H2 also, B2H6 also from this reaction. So it's an important reaction, and I hope you tricks up this for. So if you want more such tricks, do write, uh, do write about them in the comment section. And uh, if you like these videos, so please subscribe to the channel, that really helps us. So thank you, until next time.